motion picture screen opens the door to sights you've never seen before. Shock Corridor. The medical jungle doctors don't talk about. A labyrinth of twisted detours that both sexes stumble along. Case history number one. Johnny B., brilliant newspaper reporter, suffering from hallucinations that his sweetheart is his sister. Johnny. Don't ever do that! Don't you ever kiss me like that again! What's the matter? What is it, Johnny? Tell me! You're exciting the other patients by shouting! Johnny! Johnny, what do you mean? No! Diagnosis, erotic dementia. Forgive me for saying it, Miss Barrett, but there's something very strange about this case. Case history number two, Kathy B. Strip teaser, young, intelligent, beautiful. Do you think I like singing in that sewer with a hot light on my navel? I'm doing it because it pays more than shorthand or clerking or typing. I know that. Kathy's torrid performances, however, reveal her avid reaction to the excitement of male audiences. Diagnosis, manic sensuous. Case history number three, Robert T., the lone Negro student who stepped out of a white university into a straitjacket. Run, Swift, run! Run, run, run! Diagnosis, acute schizophrenia. Don't you dare strike me. I'm pregnant. Shock Corridor, the incredibly realistic story that reveals the strange intrigues the criminal impulses, the obsessions that explode into violence. Because I want her and nobody's going to keep us apart! I want her now! Daddy! Daddy! Then there was a day Johnny was trapped in the ward of love-maddened women. He's mine. He's mine. He's mine.